I remember the first football match I went to watch as a kid. It was Derby County versus Arsenal at the baseball ground, and I'll never forget it. Going to a live event like that is a huge deal for a kid, but it's not so easy for some. This is Liam, he's 11 years old, and this is his story. Liam has a fantastic personality. He's very kind, he's very chatty, but he can be as cheeky as the best of them. And of course, coming from a big football family, he loves his football. Liam's got Duchenne muscular dystrophy, and the first we knew about it was he was around two years old and he wasn't getting up off the floor or going up the stairs as we thought he should be doing. So we went to the GP and she wasn't unduly concerned, but she said, we'll refer him to the clinic. And they gave us the diagnosis there and then, which was devastating. It's a muscle wasting condition, so his legs have gone first and eventually his heart's a muscle and his lungs are a muscle and that's where we're heading, but hopefully not for years to come. With everything he has to deal with, he still smiles. He just likes to get on with life. I've always loved him since he was born. That's the best team ever. I've always supported him because my whole family have supported him, especially my mummy. In 2010, Liverpool-born businessman Barry Wells took it upon himself to give seriously ill children like Liam a once-in-a-lifetime experience. What I decided to do is get a box at Anfield which will be given over every single game to seriously ill kids who were picked by local hospitals. Kids between 8 and 18, but kids also support Liverpool Football Club. It was so successful in Anfield, so what I thought I'd do, I'd make it my mission then to go out. Anybody with the box, if you're not using the box, why do you give it up for box for kids? We'll do everything else and just make more and more memorable experiences for kids. In the five years since it launched, over 2,000 children and their families have enjoyed a Box for Kids experience, including brave young red Elliot Wilde. Elliot was diagnosed in 2009 with a very, very rare form of leukaemia. He battled for 12 months on an aggressive form of chemotherapy and it was looking good. And unfortunately, in July 2010, he relapsed. It was then found out that we didn't have a, a bone marrow match. He got the invite for Box for Kids. It was touch and go whether we were going to be able to come out, but Elliot was having none of it. We were coming out, we were going to that match. And then when I put him to bed that night, I'd give him a kiss and a hug. And he just said, do you know what, Mum? That was the best night of my life. And then a few weeks later, unfortunately, Alder Hay, we were called in and they just told us there was nothing else they could do for Elliot. We just couldn't believe it. Elliot lost his battle just two weeks later. To go to a game, an ordinary game, or be um, an ordinary supporter, shall we say, it would be too much for him. So to go in the box, it's, it's just something that he would never get. I want to see Liam with that scarf up at the beginning of the match, singing You'll Never Walk Alone, and I can feel the shivers now. I will be crying. Box for Kids is a welcome distraction from the day-to-day -day challenges faced by children like Ted, who had an open heart surgery when he was just six and 10-year-old Lucy who is deaf and suffers from a complex cardiac condition called Charge Syndrome. Or there's Ryan who has battled against a brain tumour since the age of three. For children with special needs, it like, takes their mind off it for a few hours and it makes them feel like they're, they're normal and that they're having a nice time. Why not give a box up for children? If it's an empty box, these kids get a day and they're treated like VIPs. They've got enough to deal with in everyday life. We couldn't have afforded to take Elliot in a box and have that experience and to see the, the children's faces. And Elliot talked about it right up until he lost his battle. Thank you, Box for Kids. Thank you, Box for Kids. Thank you, Box for Kids. We're not asking for money, we're not asking for people's time. We're asking people to share this video to find more box holders. Box for Kids is operated in 41 different major sports and entertainment venues across the UK. If you are a club, corporate or individual box holder and want to get involved to help make more memories, then the Barry Wells Trust would love to hear from you. Don't let your executive boxes go unused. <laughs>